Thank you all for that warm welcome, and I want to thank all the faith leaders that are here today um, working to care for our community and the human condition, and all of the folks that are here supportive of the faith community. Thank you for your effort on behalf of people um, and, and human needs in our society. I want to recognize some of my representatives that are here, Representative Solomon, Representative Agello, Representative Ackerman, Representative Lancia, Representative Tanzi, Representative Azanaro, Representative Bennett, and Rep Representative Regenberg. I hope I didn't forget anybody. Thank you for all of your hard work. And those are some, and certainly not all of the representatives that will be advocating um, for human needs and, and eradicating poverty in our society. You're fortunate in that the governor led in that you don't have to hear as long a speech, and I'm fortunate in that I don't have to give remarks that are as long, because I almost want to say I agree with the governor. Um, the best way to get us out of poverty is to create a good economy, to, to provide a place of opportunity where folks can get jobs, support their families, work and raise their families here in the state of Rhode Island and, and uh, live a happy life as is all of our goals. In the meantime, we will work to provide a safety net that is appropriate and provide security for, for persons in our state that are in need. However, the focus has to be in eradicating the safety net and not bolstering the safety net. So I thank you all for your advocacy. I will be there working with all of you and we are going to lift Rhode Islanders out of poverty. Thank you very much.